One of the top draft prospects this year is fellow Bahamian, Buddy Heal. We're here at After Dark uh, with the man from 242 to the world, Buddy Heal. And I got one question for you, buddy. Uh, first off, it's draft time. It's draft season. Uh, you're going to be drafted. What, what do you think your feelings are going to be walking across that stage, shaking Adam Silver's hands? Uh, it's going to be a lot of emotion, you know, a lot of tears. You know, I have seven brothers and sisters, and we all have been to struggle together with my mom. You know, my stepdad, Richard, he's along with us, too, and he's being a part of the struggle, too. Nobody really knows about him, but, uh, you know, that's my, my grandparents going to be there, and, like, you know, all my family who's there, and they start a struggle, you know. All that, all that emotional tears to turn into joy or happiness, you know, because it'll be relief. But uh, I still can't be satisfied yet, because uh, the best is still yet to come for me. I believe that for sure. Uh, what, what will you bring to a team? The team that drafts you, what do you feel you'll bring to that team? Uh, a, a good character kid uh, who loves to play, who loves to work, you know, who does, who do anything online, you know, who does hate losing, you know. I hate losing more than anything, you know. I just. We'll do everything, you know, whatever they need me to do. Uh, they were to play defense, and uh, I do that. But uh, and I'm gonna score at the heart, so uh, try to be the best two-way player I can be on, on and off the court. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's I think two-way game is important in this yeah. league at this level. Separates, I think, a lot of people, right? Yeah. Uh, people need to know you, you're your mentor. You're working out now with yeah. one of the greatest players to ever played a exactly. game. Kobe Bryant's taking an interest in your game. Uh, what's he passing along to you? Just mentally being mentally being focused. You know, lock in. You know, do the little things. You know. You know, uh, setting your man up, jabbing, you know, how, how you can grade space, you know, and uh, how to use the fadeaway jump shot, you know, how he teaches me how to use it, how he squares his body when he used the fadeaway jump shot. So little things like that that helps me that I can prove. The range, any concern range-wise? Because you got, you, got you got a deep shot. Uh, I'm, I'm taking a step back. Take, even further, huh? I'm taking it back. I'm going to see uh, Steph is helping make my mind change so much now, watching him play, and uh, just increase my range because I know I feel like, like when I go into the, game, in the NBA I want to impact the game with all the scoring or shooting so I got to take a step back and uh, let it go from there to respect me. Off the dribble yeah, working on the, those skills as well? Off the dribble stuff that's all I've been working on and yeah. just getting into my shot and uh, that's, that's how I get a score you know you guys not gonna let me catch a shoot unless it's on transition or they messed up on defense so uh, I've been working on all the little things I need to get to do to get better. Uh, Clay Thompson Catching shooters like yes, sir. lightning quick. He's crazy with it. Do you, I mean, yes, we sir. know the bloodline there. Yes, he He's got Bahamian blood in him. Is, yes, it, is it something that we just have I an think, advantage on? The I, catch and shoot, the I, quick release? I, I think I think we got something. I don't something know. in the water, right? It's or the conk. It's the conk. <laughs> it's the conk. It's, it's something in the water. Share about 8 Mile Rock. Yes, sir. I, I've been there. I know where, they, where yeah. 8 Mile Rock is. Yes, For you to come from yeah. the Bahamas alone, yeah. but to come from 8 Mile Rock. Yes, sir. How, people don't know how... Yeah. how small community that yeah. is. Yeah, it's a small community, uh, diverse, with a lot of Bahamians, a lot of Haitians down there. And, you know, just, you know, just had to, like, separate myself from all the crime and all the bad things and just focus on basketball, you know, whether it's being on the court, uh, being in my area of Pinedale, and just not trying to make make any trouble, you know. And uh, I had a good mother, good grandparents who I live with, and uh, they kept my head grounded. My brothers and sisters always taught me, you know, what's right from wrong. My mom, she always did everything, and uh, I just stayed locked in. I know what my vision was, and I didn't let nobody or anything sidetrack me from getting there. So you fall in the finals? I'm falling in the finals. Any uh, any predictions, any thoughts on what you see right now? Man, it's hard to go against those those Warriors, man. I know, I know right? I, I'm no dis uh, no disrespect to LeBron and the Cavs, but uh, just sometimes it's just hard to go against the Warriors. Okay, I got a story for you. What a family who? I remember you, I don't know if you remember this, you were in Freeport one time. Yeah, Junkanoo. Junk, I think it was uh, Christmas time, around that time. Yeah. I can't remember. Is it summertime or Christmas time? It was years time? ago, yeah. Uh, were you rushing? No, you signed my dollar for me. Well, Are you serious? You signed my dollar for me. I, I kid you not, you signed my dollar for me. And after that, I wake up the next morning, I couldn't find my dollar. And I was crying like a baby. Oh, uh, was, it a Penland? was it a Penland? Was it a Penland or...? I think it was American dollar. Was it American dollar? Okay. It was American dollar. And it's like, and like my, my mom would say, where's your dollar at? And I, I couldn't find it. And like, I might have spent it on candy. I could, because I, <laughs> I had it separated on, in one pocket. I can't Oh, remember. man. And I, and I, I cried, like, I cried a lot. And you my know mom would say, that's Rick Foster, get an autograph for a dollar. And you did sign it for me. I think you were one of the few that, you know, who I got to quick, because like everybody's rushing to you. Yes. And I got to you first. I don't know how I got to you. I was small. And you, you can't remember that. But, but like, watch this years later. Now I want a dollar signed by you. <laughs> I want a Bahamian it. dollar signed by you, and I For guarantee sure. you I won't lose it. I'll, I'll, it. I'll frame it. Uh, I'll, I'll let you know that Michael Thompson got three champ two championships as a Laker. I got three 
as a Laker, and I always think the Lakers are better with a Bahamian on the roster. So, <laughs> so that's just me. I think so too. That's I, I grew up with Laker fans, but uh, well, no matter, no matter, I say, no matter wherever God takes me, I'm happy with it. You know, whatever the best situation fits me, I'm good with it. Understand? Yes, sir. Buddy, he's a people. Yes, sir. Two four two to the world. Let me yeah, tell him two, to, the two, two to the world. Two four two to the world. All day.